Here we go, Cat Mel for the Cam Disc Cat 3 Mile 2, Not 130 Chase, San Pedro, Paddy, Vinnie, Gerard, Greg's Belt, James Shea, Knock, Julian, Robin, James Shea, Harvey, Area, Elliot, David Ladd, Gainesville, Frontiers, Patrick Ogan, Polk, Saladani, Martin Leiden, Up Springs Unknown, Vinnie, Gerard, Baladir, Ira, David Ladd, Master Owen, Martin Leiden, Vanishing, Paul Parsons, Shrubbery, Moulin, Alex Cherry, Corbin's Royal Padgeries, and Vermont. Alex, you 13 runners. I want to win to win this. It will probably be games throughout Frontiers. And if you don't know why, you don't know music. Pete, great Peter Gabriel song, that. Games throughout, games throughout Frontiers. Yes, I do like my music. I call, I call a lot of horses, old horses back in the day after race, after lyrics and all sorts of stuff. And I think Martin does as well. He's a real music guru. If you ever want to see Martin's music taste, you can see it at Bottom Bob Murray's page. Or with all the former entertainment he writes. He has a lovely music page you can go and visit if you like. That sort of deep purple and all sorts of music. Some weird stuff as well, I must say, Martin. <laughs> uh, some groups and women singers I've never heard of. But there you go. I'm not a music girl. Martin is. And uh, jump in the next one. Poke Solid Honey. It's a couple of clear. Gains for Frontiers. So if you ever want to be a nosy, go and look at Martin's music page. Very very into music is Martin Puck Salahani certain genre of music I say Martin Corbin's Raw and then Games for Frontiers and then this is Baladir Hyba Shambury Moulin I don't know if Martin's gonna to listen to this race he'll soon let me know if he did me commenting on his music Hope Saladani, two of Freedom's Clear, Games for Frontiers, by the dear Ivan Corbin's Raw. And jump in that one, oh, and we lost one there, and that was San Pedro Party. So one or two uh, Mini Jared's horses out of the race in the Cavendish Cup. Jump in the ditch. Oh, jump that safely. Lovely Cartmel, one of my favourite horses. To watch on the box. And summer racing is really happening when you see Cartmel and of course it's a holiday destination as well and there's a sticky toffee pudding shop up there. Doesn't look like the sticky toffee pudding in real life but there you go you can't have everything. I would love to go there one day and try the one of those sticky toffee puddings. I jump in that the rectory should be somewhere soon, or uh, maybe not. It's poke, salad, honey. Don't know what the next. Or oh, to pay them's clear. Oh, but in second place, Corbin's. Well, the one who made a mistake was the Davy Lads, Balladier, Ivo, who's now the back markup. And he's got, and he's got the other two Scottish horses towards the rear, Wim, Wormont, and Strawberry Moulin. In fact, the back four horses, all Scottish, because also towards the rear is the other. David Ladrunner, Area Elliot, although he's gone past up, Springs Unknown now. So, still a long way to go. Mile and three, of course, it's a very long one in a cartmel. From the last, it's about four furlongs long. And things can change very quickly at cartmel. And Puck Salani. Thanks to the cameraman. Oh, wait, did. That was me. <laughs> I found this race. I already know he's up, but I'm not going to let you buggers know. Poke some on me. Mean, down at three limbs clear. Corbin's Raw. Games are up front. Tears. And then can knock a doodling robin. Master Owen. Hot springs unknown. Golden Belt. Vanishing. Paul Parsons runner. Area, area. Vermont. Strawberry Moulin. It's somewhere off him. And... 
struggling. No, that's not. Uh, yeah, I'm struggling. I can't see. Oh, yes, he is about my eyes. Yeah, you can see one eye, his cherry horse has one. His other one is outside, and in fact, Raymond has been pulled out, pulled up. That's poke salad honey. Two limbs clear. Oh, that springs unknown. I don't think Martin's the type of bloke to have a salad without a bit of poke, pork, or meat with it. He doesn't seem the salad type to me, Martin. <laughs> pork salad honey. I thought it said pork. Sorry about that. It's pork, isn't it? And he jumped out and made a mistake, and there, that's the death. Wish that's the death of the commentator there for oh, Pope Salahan. And he was basically probably done now, but Master owns the leader now for Martin Eden. Here we are, yet to make good come from the rear. They're jumping out, we get to the business end now, and now they're on this very long one in for the line. And all the jumping is done with, and it's here he are by a length from his second place, Master Owen. There are a couple of lengths clear, knock Julian Robin, and then gains from up front here. That springs unknown, making ground. The rest of them are struggling quite a bit. Oh, badly, I was trying to pick up as is the poor Parsons runner, vanishing. Then come Corbin's roll, well beaten as they head towards us. The final two furlongs now, and here we are, is three lengths clear for Master Owen in second. Behind his ox springs unknown in third, and then comes Gainsborough up front, he's making a little bit of progress in fifth, his ballet dear Ivor, and then not Dylan Robin, but it's still be here, Elliot, who's towards the wheel on. This could be an easy win for Davy Lard, and the prize of the Cavendish Cup, the Cup's going to Scotland, and Davy Lard, and here we are, wins well, but five lengths clear, second of his ox springs unknown. Master Owen was third, and wait on for the fourth. Wait for the fourth. Yes, we play, and the crowd, and the holiday makers enjoying the race in the Cartmel. Not many in today, so even better. Fourth was Game of Fundy is Patrick Hogan, and fifth was Ballet de Ayer, David Ladd, 1 and 5. And I'll see you tomorrow for some hunter chasing for you. Till then, goodbye.